Hi guys, Jessica Beck here with IELTS Energy and I was just listening to a very interesting um, technology story on NPR. If you have watched this channel for a while or uh, listened to my podcast, IELTS Energy, then you know how much I love National Public Radio or NPR. So this story was so full of amazing vocabulary, I wanted to share this with you. I noted down the most interesting phrases that you can use to talk about technology in a extremely high level way. We're beyond a seven here, okay? These aren't just individual words. These are complete phrases and structures that you can use in writing task two and speaking part three. All right, let's get into it. I have a lot to share with you today. So the first one is, um, this is, this is a whole, this is a long phrase, guys. Don't worry about writing everything down, okay? Click on the show notes under this video and you will see all of these phrases typed out, all right? So, first one. Um, hackers are launching attacks on corporations as well as individuals. So if you've been reading the news, you know how, uh, how current the topic of hacking is, especially in my country. Um, so hackers are launching attacks on corporations as well as individuals. So that's the first high level phrase, okay? Secondly, this is shorter, top cybersecurity threats. So cybersecurity, right? How, online safety, that's all that is. Top cybersecurity threats. Um, threats is much better than saying dangers or problems, right? Um, so top cybersecurity threats. Um, and some of these phrases are difficult to say, so if you're planning on using these on the speaking exam, watch this video a few times and copy me as I say them, okay? Learn to pronounce these things not only correctly, but impressively. All right, next one. Um, some hackers are attacking national infrastructures like the healthcare system. So infrastructures are, um, organizational networks, all right? So infrastructure can be uh, physical infrastructure, such as roads, right? Power infrastructures, uh, power grids. In this case, it's talking about um, the complete healthcare system. So healthcare infrastructure, right? Awesome, awesome IELTS word. All right, next. Oh, I love this one, cyber espionage. So cyber, of course, is just a cool, more high level word, more interesting for online right? The web. Um, espionage. This is a great way to paraphrase hacking or hackers. Espionage is uh, like the act of spying, right? Or stealing information in a secret way. So cyber espionage. Fantastic. There are two more. You guys stay with me. Um, the next one, the banking industry is vulnerable. So the keyword here is vulnerable. All right. This means that they are um, a little bit weak. They are open to attack. They are easy to attack. Vulnerable. Great adjective. Okay. Last one. One thing you can do to solve these problems uh, as far as your personal safety is update software to monitor threats. Monitors like keep track of, right? And again, that word threats. Okay, so I went through a lot of amazing, very high scoring phrases today, and we know that technology is a common IELTS topic. So these structures, these vocabulary words, these phrases, not only amazing for speaking and writing, but you should be familiar with these words for the difficult reading passages and the difficult listening sections. Okay, so guys, this is chock full of information today. Watch a few times, read the show notes below, okay? And then practice using these phrases in your own answers. All right, uh, for more strategies about how to get the highest scores in all categories on your speaking and writing exams, as well as all the strategies you need for listening and reading, check out our online course now, The Three Keys IELTS Success System, available at allearsenglish.com forward slash K-E-Y.
S. I hope to see you in there and you have a wonderful day.